Good evening, I'm Josh Cohen. Gordon Goodall has the week off. This is the Monkey News Source. In 1996, a secret government agency set out to genetically alter the minds of lab chimpanzees. Soon the monkeys evolved and one escaped. And now, the Monkey News Source with Gordon Goodall. As expected, Daniel Day-Lewis won Best Actor in There Will Be Blood. It was reported that Day-Lewis had to leave the Oscar party early, and in his haste to take off, accidentally left his Oscar behind. When reached for comment, Daniel had this to say. I abandoned my trophy! I abandoned my trophy! I abandoned my award! For the first time since 1940, St. Patrick's Day will fall during Holy Week, the sacred seven days preceding Easter. Roman Catholic leaders are responding quickly by replacing holy water with cool, refreshing Coors Light. This week, the powerful Teamsters Union has endorsed presidential candidate Barack Obama. Union leader James P. Hoppe said that if things don't work out, there's still plenty of time to bury Barack underneath the Yankee Stadium before opening season 2008. What? What? Is that too soon? Too soon? Neverland Ranch is going to foreclose unless Michael Jackson could come up with $25 million. When asked what his next move might be, Jackson grabbed his crotch and said, hee hee hee. When asked to elaborate, he said, Jean Mon, and started skipping around like Mary Poppins. When asked if this was all a distraction to divert press attention from his love of small children, the gloved one took the blanket off of his son Blanket's head and started to cry. And finally, King Kong would have turned 75 years old this week. In a tribute to Kong and the other fallen stars of the primate world, we here at the Monkey News Source would like to end with the following tribute. For the Monkey News Source, I'm Josh Cohen, and that's the whole rack of bananas.